What's going on everybody? It's Just Adventure here with another video. Um, as you can see, we got the kayak in the back of the truck right now. We just pulled up to the spot where I'm gonna be parking to get to the pond that we're fishing today. We're gonna be doing another solo uh, kayak pond mission. Uh, I was supposed to be here with one of my buddies, but he ended up having to dip out at the last minute. He had something going on. Uh, so it's just gonna be me today. We're gonna get up here to the water and see if we can't get on a bite. So stay tuned. All right, so get everything loaded up in the kayak that we need. Um, really the only problem is um, if you've seen my last video, then you'll then you'd have seen that um, I pretty much drug my kayak all the way up the hill because it was all it's all grass and dirt and stuff um, at the last spot that I was at. But this one, the 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 road up to it is actually gravel, so I really can't drag my kayak behind me. So I'm gonna have to either just sort of carry it on my hip the whole way, which will be really hard. What I'm probably gonna do is sort of flip it up over my head if I can. I've got the seat secured back in the back, so it shouldn't fall out. Um, and then my or my paddles can uh, strap down right here, so that shouldn't fall out either. And then all my rods are secure right here. So hopefully nothing falls out and hopefully it won't be too tough of a walk up there. So let's go ahead and get started, I guess. All right, well, the gravel kind of is overgrown here a little bit, so I think we might be able to drag it for a little bit just to give the old back a break. So we've been on it for the past 10 minutes. That's a lot of weight on your spine having this thing on top of your head. Yeah, this is, it's sliding all right. We still got, we're probably about halfway there right now. So hopefully it won't be too much longer. I'm gonna be honest. When I first pulled up just a minute ago, I honestly thought the pond was just gone for a second because it's so down that usually when you uh, first roll up, you can kind of see it over the tops of all these reeds, but I literally couldn't see it at all. So I honestly just thought it was gone for a second. All right, well. We're finally out here on the pond. And I'm not gonna lie, it this pond straight up smells like poop. Like it straight up like it smells like feces out here. Which isn't the most comforting, I guess, but I guess the fish don't mind it. So so whatever. Great thing about today, there's almost no wind, so I'm gonna be able to stay in place really easily. Alright. I haven't seen or heard anything bust just yet, so I don't know. Oh, oh, there's one. Oh my God, I wasn't even looking. All right, the, well, there was one. There's one already. That's a damn good fish. Come on, come on. Man, that's a good fish for this pond. All right, chill on, buddy. He's got some cool colors on him. All right, let's see. There we go. That one's got some nice colors on him. First fish of the day. That's not a bad fish. Wow. Well. Good way to start it, threw it out in this grass over here and he came out and hit it. Good fish, all right. Thanks, thanks bud. I just said thanks. All 
Not no aggressive. Really. That's actually not bad because now it's right on the edge. Oh my gosh, that was two. That's two topwater bites that I've missed now. Oh, there's not. Oh my god. Dude, he's still. Are you serious? That was three bites in a row that he missed it. I, I didn't even get a chance to set the hook because he, he came right out of his mouth. Man. All right, yeah, these. These fish are freaking hungry. All right, let's get right back over there. See if we can get another fish or the same one. Come out and do that again. Hell, I was just pulling it in on that second one and... Whew, God, that'll get your heart racing. Nothing more fun than freaking fishing with a frog. It's like having an anxiety attack, like, constantly. Craziest freaking way to fish. I hope we can start getting some on the top water. I hope they... There's one. Oh, man! What? Okay, I don't know what's going on. Good cast, right in the corner over there. So it's, there it is. Dude, are you serious? Hell, I knew that was gonna produce a bite, but like, Oh, man. So I was talking about a minute ago. That big grass patch right over there out in the middle is usually... Oh, my God. Dude. Oh, that was a freaking crap. That was a huge fish. Oh, I saw it. Oh, my gosh. Oh, oh my God. I'm, like, shaking. That was insane. Oh. Oh my God, my hands are like shaking. That was crazy. That was a giant fish. They're not getting it all the way or something. I might need to switch frogs, make a smaller one or something. Oh my gosh, dude. I need to give them longer. I need to let them, I need to let them have it longer, I think. Oh my gosh. I freaking hope the camera got how big that fish was. That had to have been at least like a two pounder. I mean, it was huge. Let's see. See if we can get him again. Come on, man. I mean, that was a big fish for one of these backwoods ponds, man. Like, I just saw, wait, there's one. Let him have it. He didn't get it. See there, I could see it the whole time because where it's yellow, I could see it, and he, he just like went after the tail or something, I don't know. So I've switched up frogs. Um, this one's a little bit smaller. I honestly think the other one was just too big. Um, so hopefully they'll be able to get this one a little bit better and we can actually get some topwater fish. We've had a ton of bites, but just haven't been successful in getting a fish yet. There's one, first fish. That's a, is that a sunfish? God, I just caught a freaking, what? 
That is a green sunfish right there. That is the craziest thing I've ever seen. Just caught a green sunfish on top water. How many times has that happened before? It's not a bad one either. There we go. Green sunfish on top water. That is insane. All right, well, see you, bud. Dude. Oh, you can't be serious. Okay, well, let's keep going. <laughs> I'm gonna get one at, at some point, you know, like <laughs> with the amount of topwater bites that I've gotten today, the fact that I haven't caught a bass on topwater yet is insane. No, well, we just gotta keep going. Dude, oh my gosh. Oh, crap. I don't know. Oh, man, I don't know what I'm doing wrong. I'm letting them have it. I mean, I'm trying to set the hook. Go right back in there. It's like every single hook set, I'm just ripping it right out of their mouth. Oh, it's exhausting. Okay, just keep going. I'm an idiot. Big top one or blow up over there. Let's see. I don't know what's what's going on. I don't <laughs> I have no clue, man. Your guess is as good as mine. Why I keep missing them. It's like they're so aggressive, man, but it's just like I don't know. I don't know if the hooks just aren't getting them. If I'm setting the hook the wrong way, like I don't or if I'm doing like I don't know if I'm doing it the wrong direction or I'm not sure. Try to set it a different direction next time or something. What? Oh gosh, dude. There we go. I don't come up there. Okay, there we go. I was tangled up in my charging cord. Well, first fish in a while. About time. 
you know, a little one about the same size as the one we caught earlier. But fish are fish, man. And he's kind of chunky. He's got some meat on him. All right, bud. See ya. Finally got one. Finally got one on top water. There we go. Finally, man. First fish I've actually got on top water. He got that frog, man. Let's see. There we go. First actual bass on top water. Must have finally got a good hook set or something. So, all right. Appreciate it, bud. <clears throat> oh, that was a good fish. I could feel it. That was a good fish. I could feel it, man. Felt it on the line for just a quick second whenever I set the hook, and I must have just must have just pulled it out of his mouth. I guess I don't. That was a pretty good fish, though. That's a bite right there. That's got to be a bite, and that's a great spot over there. Yep, there it is. Get him out of the grass, come on. That was a nice catch. That was a that was a quality catch right there. Quality catch right there. Man, little one. These little ones, I mean, they're hitting the top water. I mean, that was a pretty big blow up for a fish, I mean this size. That's a tiny fish, you know, maybe like eight or nine inches. But, uh, yeah, dude, top water's been crazy today. All right, see you, little bud. Oh, shit, there's a big one right there. All right, come on, come on. Hurry, hurry, hurry. Oh, that was a good fish. Oh, crap. Oh, that was a good fish. Oh, my gosh. Is that a good fish? Come on, come on. Oh, it's not great. He just had a bunch of grass on him. That's a fat one, though. That's a fat fish. Damn, yeah, he's... He's chunky. It's not a huge one, but he's got some... He's got some meat on him. Yeah, man, that's a, that's a healthy fish right there. I think he just peed on me. Maybe a little bit. That's all right. See you, bud. Oh man, 
Dude, like that's a good hit. Oh man, that one about hit it right there. That was a good hit, dude. Don't know what it is. There's one. Come on, get in here. There we go. See, we're actually getting some now. I think I'm just kind of getting better hook sets and stuff, you know. That one wasn't even hooked that good. That's why you keep tension right there. That's another healthy one. These ones over in this corner over here are healthy. Might keep casting there and see if I can get any more over there. All right. Thanks, bud. Kind of getting the hang of the top water now. It's not, it was coming. It was tough earlier and now it's coming to me a little bit better. All these fish over here in this corner, man, they're all healthy. I mean, they've all got some chunk on them. Yep, nice fish. All right. I'll set them on this side. See you later, pal. Nice catch. Oh, that was a good catch. And he came off. And he's still in the boat. And he's under my chair. How did he do that? Oh, God. This is going to be a mess. Okay. There he is. Little fish. Not bad. He jumped right off and went under my chair. I had to turn around and get him. All right. See you later, bud. Have a good day. That was a good catch right there. I'm getting them now. I'm on them. Came right off. There he was right there. I just saw him swim away, too. Wasn't a bad one, but that's alright, we'll get more. Dude, oh, I just had two fighting over it. There were two fish fighting over the frog right there. I didn't mean to do that. Well, that one a bit cast off. Back over there. Two fish fighting over it. Didn't get either of them. They both hit at it. <clears throat> didn't catch either of them. It's crazy, man. Shoot, man. <sighs> it's getting bad out here, boys. It's getting bad. Oh, it's getting bad. It's a struggle out here, man. It's a struggle bus, and I'm the freaking driver out here, man. It's crazy. Well, just pulled the kayak up out of the pond. Um, actually, just about stepped on a snake right as soon as I stepped out of the kayak, and he ran up under that rock right there. So we're just going to leave him alone. Um, but it was actually a really good day on the water, even though, you know, I probably missed like, heck, 80% of the blow-ups that I had on top water. Um, but there were still a few really good catches. I got a few on the Texas rig. Uh, overall, not a bad day. Uh, so I'm going to head back down to the truck now, and I'll see you there.
and we are back in the truck. Uh, pretty good day overall. You know, got a lot of bites, but couldn't capitalize on as many as I would have liked to, I guess. But um, I'm gonna go get some grub. I've been out on the water since like nine this morning and it's about one o'clock right now. So I'm starving. Uh, and thank you for watching the video. Leave a like if you enjoyed it and uh, subscribe and I'll see you in the next one.